this song. And I'm just going to do it like we used to do it in the foothills of North Carolina. I won't have any microphone. I guess you can just try to pick. You don't even have to do that. Don't really need it. Well, I grew up in the foothills of North Carolina. And uh, we'd go to church. And a fella just every now and then would uh, pick up the guitar. And they'd start playing. Or they'd start singing. I'll meet you in the morning. Something like that. And uh, boy, it made an impact on me. When I was some of these young men's age. Seeing those fellas go to the house of the Lord, pick up their guitar and begin to play and begin to sing. And uh, to this day, I remember those times. So a few years ago, the Lord gave me a song about the Bible. I believe, and I know you believe this too, but I believe the Bible is the inspired Word of God. I believe it is inerrant. I believe that it is infallible. I believe that it is impeccable. I believe that it is indestructible. Amen? I love the Word of God. If I'm going to stand tonight on something, I want it to be for the truths of the Word of God. Amen? So here's a song the Lord gave me a few years ago about the Bible. I'm going to do it just like we used to do at the foothills of North Carolina. Amen? Some say it's outdated and too hard to be. Others may claim it just can't be believed. Some have even said that its contents are true, that its message is irrelevant for me and for you. But God said it's a light to my path in the dark. It's the sword of the Spirit in the armor of God. It's pure, it's holy, and respect it's demanded. So on this book, I'm still standing. I'm still standing on the word that's true. I'm still believing in the truth and through. From the book of beginnings to God's revelation, it's all God's word and not man's speculation. Heaven and earth, they may all pass away, but this old book is still abiding today. God's holy word I will never abandon, I'm still standing. So brother, where do you stand on the Bible today? We you hold to its truth or explain it away? We you stand for what's right? We you stand for what's true? Cause when you stand for the Bible, that's just what you do. Let's preach it and teach it to men great and small. Let's share it, declare it to even one and to all. Brother, this truth, the word of God is demanded. So on that truth, I'm still standing. I'm still standing on the word that's true. I'm still believing it through and through. From the book of beginnings to God's revelation. It's all God's word and not man's speculation. Heaven and earth, they may all pass away. But this old book is still alive. 